it's Sunday morning. I can already tell today is going to be a pretty slow day, but I guess we'll see what happens. What's up? It's like, oh, it's like 6.30 at night right now. I literally didn't do anything today. Uh, I think like the most I did today was just, I went out and I got food and coffee this morning. And that was about it. I mean, this is like the usual Sunday. I really, I don't like Sundays just for this reason specifically. Uh, I feel like just nothing happens. It's always so boring on Sundays. I don't know. And I mean, maybe that's just me. Sundays are always very uneventful and just usually not really productive at all. So yeah, I'm not really a fan of Sunday at all, but looking forward to tomorrow and just kind of, you know, getting back on the schedule, going for a run in the morning, hopefully. Yeah, just looking forward to starting the week tomorrow and being able to get back into the routine and just getting back into the gym and everything, getting good workouts in. So it's gonna be good, looking forward to this week. I have to be an adult later and go grocery shopping, so that's gonna be pretty exciting. I really don't like going to the store earlier. I like going later at night, just because like, whenever I go and it's crowded, it's just, it makes everything so much more difficult. So I like going really late at night, just so there's like, there's no one there and I can just get in and get out as quickly as possible. Just cause it's like, I don't know, grocery shopping is like, it's just so annoying when there's a whole bunch of people around. Like, it makes it a lot more difficult when there's a whole bunch of people around. It's just hectic. I don't know, that's how I feel anyway. It's it's kind of funny. I feel like so much more tense when I'm in there and there's a whole bunch of people around. I don't know, it's weird. Probably gonna go later. Um, I don't know, I'll probably go there at like eight or nine o'clock. Yeah, the one time I was there, I noticed that they got this robot there now and it's really weird. I don't even know like what it does. It just kind of like roams around the store and I guess it, I think it actually like looks for spills and it'll announce it on like an intercom or something. But yeah, it's real strange. And I remember the one time like I was walking out and like I passed it. I didn't know like, it was the first time I saw it. I was like, it looks like it's about six and a half feet tall. So it's like pretty tall. And yeah, I was looking at it. I had no idea what it was. And I was like walking out because it was right next to the doors. It said the weirdest thing. It said um, it was like caution threat detected. And I was like, what is this thing? Yeah, it's really weird. It's weird to see like robots in stores now. I think I saw a video once where it was in like a Chinese airport. They have they have robots just like going around, but this is the first one that I saw. That's pretty weird, I don't know. I know this is a pretty short video. Um, I do apologize, but I still wanted to make something. That's the problem is like, I was sitting around all day today, like just like really on the fence of like even making something or not. But like when I went out earlier, like I already started and I recorded so much earlier and I just, I didn't want to not finish today's episode just because I had all that already recorded. So. I didn't want to like give up. I wanted to do something. I wanted to finish this, but I know that it's really not going to be much of an episode at all. So I do apologize for that. It's, it's a Sunday, so there's really not much going on. I didn't want to not finish it. So, but yeah, it just, it sucks because pretty much all day, I just kind of like sat around thinking of like what I could do, like how to finish this episode. And I just, I really didn't come up with anything at all. Like maybe that was the problem though, is I was just sitting around not doing anything, just trying to think of something to do rather than actually, you know, getting up and just turn the camera on and start recording. Cause I mean, even right now, like I've been going for, yeah, like six minutes right now, just talking, even though there really wasn't much to it and I didn't really do much today. It's just nice to be able to finish the whole thing. I was really like, I was getting really frustrated earlier cause I knew I had, I had all that already done. So yeah, it just, it would have been really upsetting if I didn't finish it. Not a fan of Sundays at all, just cause nothing happens. I still have to order that desk too. I keep putting that off and I need to do that because like I said, this one is just not good at all. I'm sorry that this episode is kind of lame. I still want to put something out there, so. Hi. 
Hi, it's like, uh, it's a little after 10 o'clock at night. So it, yeah, it's pretty late right now. Yeah, something really clicked for me earlier. I felt like I was in a rut earlier just because like, I, I really had no idea what I wanted to record today. Um, and like I said earlier, like I already started as the day went on, I just, I really wasn't feeling too confident about recording anything at all. And I was even thinking about just deleting it all because I really just didn't have any ideas at all. Like, I think that the problem was I was just sitting in bed trying to think of what to make a video about and like what I should talk about today or what I should do. That was absolutely the problem. Like, rather than just sitting around trying to think about doing something, I think that it's always better to just start doing it. I mean, for me, it's just, you know, turn the camera on and start talking. But, you know, for anyone else, maybe it's painting, just, you know, pick up the brush and just start going. I think that sometimes you just kind of have to start working and it'll just come to you in the moment. That's kind of how it went today for me. Uh, I was really struggling and I think that it's because I was just, I was thinking too much. Once I turned the camera on and started talking earlier, it, it got a lot easier. I was able to make something today, so it was kind of nice to actually just, you know, sit down and get to work. And I think that that's a problem. So like, if you're ever struggling with that, like trying to find a creative idea, sometimes it might just be best to just start and just get to work. and just not even really think about it, but to just jump right into it. And you never know, something might come to you as you're working. So, I mean, that's kind of that's kind of what happened for me today. So it was kind of a nice feeling. Um, I'm glad that I was able to actually record something today because it really had me down today. I was kind of upset with myself because I, I almost felt like defeated, like as if I wasn't gonna make something today because I kind of knew that you know, I didn't have any ideas, so, and, and then thinking about deleting the stuff from before. So yeah, it kinda, kinda had me down before, but you know, I'm glad that I was able to make something. So yeah, feels good. If you're ever having trouble trying to create something, I guess sometimes that's all you have to do is just jump right into it.